Horses are out for race number six. An Isoba test for two-year-old pacing Colts. Here's that field, number one, Jimbo Jack, owned by Ron Phillips of Petersburg, by Fergie of Plattsville, Colorado. Mike Rogers trains, Sean Walker drives. Coupled in the wagering, 1A, also trained by Rogers, is the Samuel Greer-owned TC Society Man. Mike Rogers is behind TC Society Man. Two is Happy Caper, owned, trained, and driven by Donovan, Illinois' Brett Wilfong. Three, Gore, owned by Mount Sterling's Ed Teefy. Donna Lee trains, Dean McGee drives. Four, Mellencamp, owned by John Kokinkos of Madison, Wisconsin. Don Nolan trains, Dave McGee is up. Five, Fox Valley Typhoon, owned by Benita Simmons of Springfield, by Fergie and Lowe of Denver, Colorado. Tom Simmons, the trainer driver. Six, Fox Valley Miracle, owned by Fox Valley Standardbreds of Sherman. Tony Alanya trains and will drive. And number seven, Tribal Chief, owned by Kerry O'Stable of Huntington Beach, California, by Irvin Miller of Springfield. Miller, the trainer, It'll be Andy Bishop Miller Form, in the bike. Isoba, help support the sport. We, too, urge you to join IHHA, their booth at the north end of the grandstand. Right now, Isoba, two-year-old pacers at the post, the gate rolling, and here they come. They're often pacing from the outside. Quickly for the lead goes TC Society Man. Out quick also is Fox Valley Typhoon. On the inside, Happy Caper gets away with him. Far outside, Tribal Chief rushes fourth. Fifth on the inside is Jimbo Jack as that field powers into the turn. Headed now toward the quarter mile mark. Getting out next now as I swing that way is Gore. Racing on the inside, seven is Fox Valley Miracle. And at the back of the field, Mellencamp as they drive to the quarter. And on the outside, ranging up there goes Tribal Chief. He races to the front for Andy Miller just past the quarter. That marker in 27-3, rolling as they hit the back stretch. And Tribal Chief now will control the tempo of this one. He's made the lead. Behind him, second now is TC Society Man as they straighten down the backside toward the half-mile mark. Fox Valley Typhoon scoots along the inside, third. Behind him, racing four, is Happy Caper, five, as they drive that way, Jimbo Jack, racing six, five. Fox Valley Miracle, seven, is Mellencamp, and now trailing the field of two-year-olds is Gore as they reach the half. They're past that station in 56-3, good front half by the two-year-olds. are in the upper turn, Tribal Chief heads them behind him, getting a good trip now. Second is TC Society Man on the outside game. Here comes Jumbo Jack off the rail. He was fourth, now third, ranging up without cover as they had toured three quarters. On the inside, getting the shuffle fourth is Fox Valley Typhoon. Outside him, Fox Valley Miracle is next. Following Fox Valley Miracle comes Mellencamp. Seventh on the inside is Happy Caper. Gore at the back. They're at the three-quarter. And the leader there is Tribal Chief stalking him second. TC Society Man. They wrap that marker, 127, top of the lane after a breather third quarter. They turn for home. And the leader in the lane is the uh, two-year-old Tribal Chief. He has seven behind him to the outside. Here comes TC Society Man, far outside Fox Valley Typhoon rushes. But the leader to the wire, Tribal Chief, Andy Miller is going to get another win. Tribal Chief home by a length and three quarters. Second TC Society Man, third was Fox Valley Typhoon, four to uh, Happy Caper. Finishing five, Fox Valley Miracle. Six appeared to be Gore over Mellencamp. And trailing was Jumbo Jack. And now into the winner circle, Andy Guides, Tribal Chief, trained by his brother Irvin, who last year had the Illinois champion two-year-old pacing Colt and the Illinois champion undefeated two-year-old pacing Philly, both winners of the orange and blue in his stable. So a big year by Irvin Miller last year and a big year unfolding for Irvin Miller this year. Now it's the Cario Stables and Irvin Miller's Tribal Chief picking up the Isoba Blanket presented by Brenda Watson, John Cessna, the Executive Secretary. Trackside all day today. This winning two-year-old by Cole Muffler from the Storm Damage Mother Fire Ant bred by co-owner Cario Stable of Huntington Beach, California. The Brothers Miller, Andy, and the bike, Irvin, the trainer, now down to Kurt Becker. All right, thank you, Carl. We are with winning trainer Irvin Miller. 
Irv, I don't know how many uh, two-year-olds break their maiden in their first lifetime start at 154 and three. That's pretty impressive. The question is, why has he not made a money start until today? Uh, he was just a little late getting started, and then he got a little sick on me, so I had to back off of him. That'll do, and I tell you what, when I walked up, I said, you got a minute, Irv? He said, no, not really. He's got a lot of horses yet to race. We'll let him get going. Irv, congratulations.